In the fast moving digital world, the ability to link company sites around the globe and access computer systems at different locations from anywhere is becoming more important than ever. Yeah, not only since COVID has it been necessary to interconnect different sites, users or IT administrators who need to access and administer computers from anywhere and ideally down to BIOS level. But at this point, access and maintenance quickly becomes tricky or even at times impossible. So for these and apparently many other applications, we've spotted the new remote access gate from Guntermann and Drunk. So who else than Jochen Bauer to tell us all about it? Hi Jochen, welcome back to the show. It's good to see you. Tell us, <laughs> what's new since we last spoke? Um, hello Simon, hello Matt. Thanks for having me. And yeah, um, since um, I assume since our last meeting, um, which was one of the first we did from our new control center here, um, we were quite busy um, working on that. Um, it's been very well received um, and um, highly frequented with um, customer demos from from that yeah, perfect demo environment here. And um, yeah, the other news we've got since is this new device, um, which you already mentioned, our remote access gate, which allows remote access to any kind of IT system. And um, the big advantage is that you can drastically limit the bandwidth, the, the needed bandwidth um, compared to our um, so far IP systems. Um, you know, our control center IP system, which offers a full matrix capability, um, is working rather on LAN structures, um, typically um, occupying a, a gigabit bandwidth. And with this device now, you can um, yeah, even work via internet bandwidth or via, via standard IP connection. And um, the device itself is kind of a standalone device, so you can directly connect it to a computer, to a computer interface, and re remotely operate that computer via an internet connection. But what you can also do is that you can connect it to a comprehensive KVM system, and by that, from a remote location, um, access all your in-house IT structure. Um, the way we usually put it is your access is important, your location may not. And um, so this gives you um, a lot further advantages, not only in times of a pandemic, but um, of course also beyond, whether it's simple IT administration that you have to fulfill from the outside, um, or it's, of course, in, in the current situation, work from your home office and you need access to all your systems or, um, yeah, maybe for, for the outside production. So um, if you're outside and you need full access to, to all the, the machines um, in, in, the stu in, the, in the broadcasting center, um, that would be the right solution. So uh, th this isn't your first uh, product that has remote access for, over the internet. Not all of your products are um, LAN based. How does this differ from previous products? Um, back, actually, it's not um, our very yeah. first product. We um, offered a similar solution with our previous um, analog matrices um, already, but um, ever since we were waiting for the new solution, which I'm holding in my hands right now. And um, yeah, of course, it differs um, from, from the capabilities, from, um, from the performance. Um, yeah, you, you get really fluid access and um, and um, um, brilliant video um, via this, um, even if taking into account the, the limitation of the bandwidth. And um, the big advantage to, to further um, or different approaches for remote access, like with RDP or VNC protocols, is um, that via this device, you gain the, the full access even down to bias level. You don't have to install any software. Um, so that keeps you the, the full performance of your system on site. So just right. picking up on that bias level access there, Jochen, um, yeah, allowing level or allowing access to that level, what about security? Is it a bit risky? Um, of course, security is paramount. And good thing you're, you're um, highlighting this. And um, so um, as you can expect from, from GND, um, this comes with all the, the built um, solid safety parameters with all state-of-the-art encryption. So there's no need to worry about this. Um, as, um, of course, this 
can give you full access to all your in infrastructure. And um, so, of course, we, we took good care of, of our clients' um, security, and um, that's all included here. And you said, so if it's going over public IP on low bandwidth, what about um, the, the resolutions? Does, does it support the full range of resolutions we would expect? Um, of course it does. Um, it's um, kind of state of the art, even if we somehow have to compress um, all the, the video information to get it um, over low bandwidth um, internet connections. Um, but um, yeah, it supports full 2K60 resolution or you can um, enter 4K30 so you can even um, operate 4K computers. And is the um remote access gates um, available now, Jochen, have you got any people using it? Um, it's available and shipping since early January already. And um, so um, whoever wants to use it, um, wants to test it, yeah, we're, ha we're happy to provide it. So it does uh, all of the resolutions. Does it also support multi-head uh, monitors effectively? Um, indeed, it supports multi-head video, it supports multi-user access, um, it even provides a local console so that you can, besides transmitting the signals over the internet, you can still locally operate the computer, so that's all part of the device, yeah. Great, so it's, it's available now, Jochen. Well, how can people find out more information? Um, yeah, for this special device here, um, we, we have to make sure, um, although it includes some magic, um, it can't fulfill um, miracles. So um, it's all down to your individual <laughs> bandwidth, and um, that's um, where the performance comes from. And for all um, who want to find out more and want to make their own impression, um, we're offering a demonstration access here at our premises, so you can log in from the outside and, um, and have a demo yourself. Um, and for that and further information, just have a look at our website, get in touch. We're happy to provide further. Thanks, Jochen. Brilliant. We'll put a, a link in the description cool. of the video below. Thanks for coming on once again, telling us about this new development. There's a massive array of applications there, so I'm sure people will check that out. Thanks also to Media Proxy for supporting the show as always, and you can find out more about them at mediaproxy.com. We'll see you next time.